everybody. Welcome back to my channel. It's Theoni with Thrifty Divas. So I just left uh, court uh, and my mom still has my son from when I went to court. And today is Wednesday. So it is six color tickets at the thrift store. So I they still wanted to play a little bit and go in the pool, etc., etc. And uh, I asked her, I said, oh, do you want, should I just run to the thrift store quick now? And she's like, yes, but make it quick, because <laughs> she knows me. So we're going to go take a look at the thrift store with the six color tickets. It is 311, though. It'll be 315 by the time I get there, so I don't know how much will be left. But uh, I'm going to bring you guys along with me today and see if we can find anything. So let's head to the thrift store. I'll see you guys inside. All right, the first thing I'm gonna do is flip through some vinyl. I'm always hopeful that I'll find something cool, but it never quite works out for me. There's never anything good or desirable. Yeah, I'm not really seeing anything. I always check. Because I remain hopeful, but no, nah, there's nothing worth picking up here. And there's actually a few movies I'm looking for that I can never find. But I did find something. So I'm going to go ahead and look it up quick. And, um, all right, I'm going to filter this to brand new condition, see what the difference is. And we're a little higher here. But let's see what the demand is for it. So I'm going to go ahead and filter this to sold. Check it out. <laughs> Nothing. So, uh, but I can't leave this behind. So I'm going to go ahead and pick that up anyway. Next, they have this huge bin of all these brand new glitter cases. They're brand new. They come in silver and teal. Still have tags on them. And they want $1.99 half price. So they're a dollar. I'm going to go ahead and pick up a few of these for myself or to put gifts in. I'll grab like three and go ahead and put these in the cart. Looking in the case, I see not much, but I see that NYX advent calendar, but it looks to be open. So we'll leave that. Moving on to some of the glassware. I see this toll crystal lead crystal uh, it's a fair price at half half price but i'll leave that i think and i see these mikasa candle holders I see actually a bunch of them so this is a uh, 450 for a pair of two those are pretty nice actually and then I noticed this is Ornamental Glow by Lennox right away. Um, but they're asking, what is that? That would be seven fifty and nine on on this one. So I I don't think that's that's not good. I'm gonna take a look just to verify and nah, not at that price. It's not worth it. So those can stay there. Looking through the bags, and I'm kind of disappointed. None of them look uh very promising for me today. Strolling through some of the toys, see if anything jumps out. And here's a like a Batmobile. My son would probably love that. But he's got <laughs> he's got enough cars right now. But it is pretty cool. And they want they want three dollars for it. That's that's fair. But and this Spider-Man thing. I always like to flip through to see if I can find any cool vintage t-shirts hopefully like vintage band t-shirts but this thrift store happens to stink there's just never anything good never any good vintage t-shirts here this uh, is wanting to look vintage but turns out it's old navy so <laughs> and that's a double stitch so oh i kind of like this one for me 
But yeah, we always seem to get like family reunion t-shirts in here or work t-shirts. Yeah, there's nothing good in here. All right, let's move on. Next, I always like to look to see if there's any cool vintage hats, anything collectible or desirable. And again, this store usually stinks with the vintage hats too. I feel like they don't even put them out. Like they think they're bad or something. But again, nothing good. I'm going to swing by the men's shoes, see if anything is worth looking at or talking about these looked good they're london fog no big deal um strolling through strolling through Those are nothing great. These Dr. Scholl's, I was thinking for my husband, but they want $19 for them. So, no, we're good on that. Thought these looked interesting, but they're really not. All right, so these are catching my eye. I don't know what these are, but let's see, 12, uh, 12 50 they want on those because they're half price. And it says Lucchese. I'm going to go ahead and look them up just for fun because I like learning things. All right, so I'm not too surprised to see that they're a little pricey because a lot of boots are. I'm going to... Go down to sold comps, and I see, let me make sure they're used, so I'm going to filter condition, used, and I mean, it's potential, potential, but I still have those red wings, so I don't want to load myself up on any boots right now. And they're a size nine, so I feel like they're a little small. But, all right, let's move on. See these interesting trains, but I don't know a dang thing about trains, so can't tell if it's good or not. And they're, they're full price. They must have just put these out, so. But interesting to look at. I'm going to flip through the board games and stuff, see if there's anything worth picking up. What's that? backgammon it's only a dollar but and it's this harry potter a coding kit no oh look a 1986 stratego only 250 but i don't have time to go through all the pieces right now nfl rush zone all right now i'm in other glassware <laughs> they want $19 for that, so they can keep that. <laughs> and then with the Brilliant Cut Glass, I always like to feel it. The sharper, the better. These are kind of cool. These are uh, collectible Arby's glasses from 1978. Three of four. All right, right away I see these little votive holders they look mikasa to me like totally but i can't i can't make that out let me see there's like four more up here yeah see they are mikasa uh but i don't know i'm just, I'm just being very very picky which is good i'm being picky with what i actually take home my mom would love that, but it's too small <laughs> for her taller. 
She loves that kind of pottery, though. This is cute. Little Jelly Belly cupcake. And then these are kind of cool. If they were half price, I think I would have grabbed them. But these are old casino ashtrays. So they have the uh, Golden Nugget Horseshoe Showboat. But that's it, guys. I'm going to head back to the car now. And uh, I'll meet you at home to show you what I selectively brought home with me. <laughs> Hey guys, so we're back at the house now. Um, I couldn't film as much as I would have liked to because I was under a time crunch because I had to get back to go pick up little man from my mom. So next time when I have more time, I'll make sure to film more of what I'm looking at. I couldn't do everything because I was trying to look thoroughly and get back in time. So I had to look things up and you know. So anyway, uh, it was an okay day, not really that great. First thing I got though, he gave me these two free brand new bags from the Disney store. So we got Ariel and we got a uh, Sophia the first. The Sophia the first one is cool because it has a little pocket in there. But anyway, yeah, and they both still have their Disney store tags on them. So that was a fun find, I guess. Well, a fun gift, I should say. So, all right, let me show you um as you saw in the video when i started looking through the bags at first there was really nothing good at all but they ended up putting more out um, or they showed up from somewhere because they were a half price colored ticket and some of them looked opened but they were huge bags for a great price so i flipped through them a little bit and they looked great so i ended up picking up a few bags after all so a couple of things uh, aren't here right now so the first thing I had to leave at my mom's because I couldn't fit it and little man in the car together so I'll put that right here so the first thing is this shoe rack this stand against the wall shoe rack now it is missing a couple uh, here and there but that's totally fine with me it was $14.99 50% off so $7.50 and I thought it would save space in my closet so I'm kind of excited about that and the next thing uh my mom actually swung by there after i left her house and there was a thing i had a second thought about and i asked her to pick it up for me so she did so it is right here so this covered dish caught my eye and it was 6.99 50 percent off so 350. i couldn't decide on it and i ended up walking away from it but uh come to find out it's libby orchard fruits and i think for 350 that was an amazing price so my mom went back and grabbed that for me okay so those are the two items that I purchased that aren't well one my mom purchased that aren't here with me so i just wanted you to get the Full idea of what was purchased sorry no particular rhyme or reason as usual so they had this in the wrong spot they had this in the board game section it is this Fujiyama Mon Amour three-piece perfume set still factory shrink wrapped you get the 3.3 uh, fluid ounce perfume three point they're all 3.3 fluid ounces so you get the perfume the perfumed body lotion and the perfumed shower gel and this was $3.99 half off. So I got that for $2. I'll probably just keep that for myself. That's a, that's a crazy price. Uh, next thing, I just picked up this pillow for downstairs, like in our movie room, because we also have like the sports area there too. So it's this Giants pillow, and it was only $2.99 half price. So that was $1.50. I didn't look out and find any Cowboys pillows in New York, so shocker, but I got that from my husband. Next, I picked up this. I always grab these when I see them because they, they tend to be really good prices there. I think I'm going to put this in the garage because I have to reorganize the garage, but it's this three drawer. I don't see any brand on it at all, <laughs> at all, which is odd. Whoa. Whoa. But it is, uh, yeah, this little three drawer. And that was 
$4.99 half price, so it was $2.50. Okay, next, I found these. They have some chips and stuff, but I just, I thought they were adorable. So this is by Tabletops 365 Ceramic Gallery, dishwasher safe, made in China. They have a couple of little nicks, one each, I think. But they were they were a dollar ninety nine half price each. So for a dollar each, I got these little ceramic popcorn containers. I just thought they were really cute downstairs for the movie room. Okay, then really really not much today, guys. Then I just picked up this towel. It is it was two ninety nine half price. So it was a dollar fifty. I'm going to wash it in laundry sanitizer and uh, use it for my son for farm camp. One of the things that they want in his backpack is a towel. They also want them to have a bathing suit available. I don't know why. <laughs> There's no pool or body of water there, but maybe they'll do some sprinkler games. I don't know. Um, but I got that so I don't have to worry about any of my towels getting messed up. Then I got this for myself, probably. It was $4.99, half price, so it was $2.50. And it's just this really cute New York Mets shirt. Um, now, this was obviously a promotional item at a game at City Fields because this is a sausage brand. <laughs> so that's on the sleeve. Whatever. But yeah, that was $2.50. I, I liked the logo other than the than the sausage brand whatever and then you saw in uh in the video there was a box of these and these are modella fashion forward and they actually have 12.99 original price tags on there and they had them for a dollar 99 half price so they were a dollar each and all it says is glitter happens which hey that's a good life motto so i got one in the like turquoise multicolor glitter and then they're they're black satin on the other side with glitter happens they're just really nice cases so one in the turquoise and i got two in the silver it's got a couple of speckles of color in there but mostly silver same back two of those in the silver and in in the second one that i got i put something in there to protect it so i picked these up just as a gift they actually had two more but i don't know so these are and i don't remember if i showed myself picking these up in the video but I recognized them right away and I could tell that they were Mikasa. So these are Mikasa handle, uh, candle holders. So they wanted, and the uh, the sticker's still on there, on one of them. Um, they, these were $8.99 half price. And then they had another set without the sticker for two of them for $6.99 half price for both of them and then this single one so there was five all in total but this single one with the sticker was a dollar ninety nine half price so a dollar so four fifty on these a dollar on this so five fifty three Mikasa uh, it says Slovenia candle holders I I just wanted to uh hold on to these this would be like a really nice like wedding present or something I don't know or just a Christmas present but I thought that was that was kind of good no chips at all mint condition all right so that's that then I couldn't resist this so uh I don't know if I will hold on to this or sell it, but it is still factory sealed, although it has a tiny little tear I just saw. I might have done that when I threw it in the bag. Who knows? I don't really know. But it's a VHS of Serpico. 
wrapped and it was a dollar 99 half price so for a dollar that's just amazing so I got that and this next item is gonna go in the next package for my friend Patty and William over at Patty's Chance Holes and more. So guys, if you're watching, just click forward like a minute. I'll let you do that. Okay. So this was full price at $1.59. Blue was basically the only one that wasn't reduced at all. But it is this Mickey Mouse. So it, it says Disney on the side there if that'll focus and then you got the mickey heads and it says stir it up the hole is a mickey head too and it's the spoon so i thought that was perfect for them all right i think we're down to bags guys that's it all right so we got three huge bags the first one was $2.99 half price, $1.50, and you can see it was opened. All right. Maybe you guys can help me out like you have in the past. So this is some kind of, it has a rubber band there, I think to like, so you, like it's like a battering ram, so you can push it and then release it. I don't know. Um, no marking of any value. So there's that. And then this says City Bus Senti Toys, scale one to 70. It looks kind of old. So what did we say this bag was? $1.50, right? Okay, and then, oh. Oh, this does something. There's an on-off switch, but I don't know where the battery would be. It talks, it's a tow mater. And it talks, and it's, it's actually metal. It's pretty heavy. So that's cool. And this is a Monster Jam Hot Wheels. I don't know. And then we have this motorcycle. this little car and you'll see you'll see uh, the reason of why I bought some of these bags um, this is a 2013 Sega Sonic car so I will probably be keeping this And this is a 2014 Nintendo. What was it? I can't even remember his name. Koopa something? Ko I can't remember. King Koopa? Something like that. That's mine. This is a little Burger King car from October 09 to January 2010. This is a 2008 Nintendo Donkey Kong figure. This will also be mine. Ooh, this one looks old. I don't know if it is though. 
It's metal. It says Malaysia. It is a Hot Wheels Datsun Bluebird 510. This is another Hot Wheels with surfboards on top. And this is another Hot Wheels 2002 Mattel Thailand. All right, that's one bag. I'll try to go quickly. This was also $2.99 half price, so $1.50 for this huge bag. Uh, first thing, 2013. I'm sure this is from something. This little pink dragon. This is, oh, I feel like I know, is this, what is this from? Vampirina or something? I don't know, but it's a McDonald's toy. And it's supposed to talk, but it doesn't. Oh, this is cool. 2007. It's a little hockey player. Oh, that's cool. Another hockey player. I'll probably, I'll put these up downstairs too. Another hockey player. Rangers. Three, three Rangers. There's a goalie. But we're, uh, <laughs> we are not Rangers fans here. And another Rangers. This cool little dinosaur. It's got the Jurassic World logo on its foot, so that's cool. Crappy plastic car. Little white kitty. Another little dragon. Mm, this looks like it fell off of something, so I'll keep that in case it pops up. <laughs> Man. So this was a 2007 little action news van, but some kid wrote Ben 10 on it. Another Hot Wheels 2003 stunt team, little metal Hummer. This is a 2007 Matchbox police car. This is a Maisto 1998 Dodge Viper. This is a little, little crappy plastic car. Oh, this is a Dollar Tree car, but it's metal. Look at that little police thing. It said Greenbrier International on it. Uh, Little police helicopter missing one of the rails on the bottom. This is a 2009 Chrysler Hot Wheels. A lot of Hot Wheels. Nice, nice, nice. This is a little Batman on a motorcycle. He's gonna love that. This is a little SWAT car. Another Hot Wheels 2002 metal. This is a Hot Wheels 2004 plastic. This is a 2002. I don't know what it is, but it's metal. This is a Disney Pixar metal. Car, I believe from cars, right? This is another metal Hot Wheels. Crappy plastic car. One of the reasons why I grabbed this bag coming up right now. Little Nintendo Mario figure. 2007 Nintendo Yoshi figure, 2007 Jumping Mario Nintendo figure, 
another Rangers guy. A little pink bunny. A random uh, shower curtain hook. <laughs> Those look like they were cute at one point. Uh, this is another Mario Nintendo figure. This is a Hot Wheels. It says horse play on the bottom. And then we got a Luigi. Another Luigi. I mean, one of those alone was worth the dollar fifty, in my opinion. Made in China metal taxi. This is a Volkswagen Beetle. No markings on that. Another little Yoshi. Hot Wheels metal. 1983 so that stays with me this is a DC Comics Hot Wheels awesome awesome son's gonna love that a cheesy little police motorcycle whatever that is a little fire department car that's literally what it says on it. This is a 2008 car. Another little kitty. 1992 Ford Mustang. A little Hot Wheels quad. Another little kitty. This guy from Nintendo. So I keep that too. Almost done, almost done, yay! This little guy from Nintendo, I keep that too. Some other little red car. Okay, that was that bag. Last bag. I think that last bag was totally worth the $1.50 though, no? And I just ripped this off without showing you. Also $1.50 on this one. I have no idea what this is, but he's in there. Um, this also had an on off switch. This is by Scholastic. This is a 2018 Jeep Wrangler. This is a metal airplane, 2002 Mattel. That's nice, it's all metal. Versus this completely plastic crappy one. Oh, nice. Nice, nice, nice. It's a DC Comics car, 2015. Little Joker vehicle. And that does something too, I think. I don't know, it has a button on it. Um, this says Disney. This is from Cars also, I think. And then this says Disney Pixar also from Cars, I think. Now, this train is interesting. It says Penny Whistle. Now, if you saw in the video, they were actually selling these separately for not cheap. I don't know. I mean, they were like $3.99, $6.99 each, but they missed one. So it's this metal, metal train made in China though. So I don't have any hopes on that. Oh, nice. A nice little, it looks like some type of Batmobile. We're almost done guys. I'm blazing through here. This is a 2006 Mattel metal. Another hockey player. A 
little purple plastic car. A really crappy plastic plane. Yoshi on a motorcycle. Yeah, I keep that one too. Disney Pixar again, cars. Chevy Impala, Disney. That's from cars. This is a what? 1977. So I will be keeping that one. This is a 2000 Evil Twin, it's called. 2006 little truck. This doesn't have a year, but it says Formula Street Metal. 2008, it's a Chrysler Metal. Last but not least from the Nintendo stuff, the Princess. All right, so that's it, guys. Not like a crazy good one. So that's it, guys. Not like a crazy good one. Um, but again, I did go late in the day as well, like I said. So uh, hopefully next week I'll hit it up again and maybe we'll have better luck. But I just wanted to show you what I got this time around. And I'm definitely going to keep these uh, 70s and 80s ones because that is crazy. And yeah, that's going to do it for today, guys. So until the next video, stay blessed, my friends. Thank you for hanging out with me to look at this stuff. And until the next video... So thank you for hanging out with me today to look at this stuff. And until the next video, stay blessed, my friends. I love each and every one of you.